In every war, there is an enemy. I watched my mother being half beaten to death and watched as blood and tears streamed down her face. I felt useless and scared and furious at the same time. I could still feel the sting of the belt on my back and my legs. One time, he couldn't pay the rent. And that night, he stopped us on the street and pointed to the concrete. He said, pick a spot. Clyde was my boy. He had my back plenty of times. We was like one fist, me and him, one army. Shit right here. Nobody jumps us now. We gotta practice. Cause this, this got power. You shoot it, it's like you shoot it. I sat there until the police came. But when they come, all they see is a dead body, a gun, and a nigga. They took me to juvenile hall. First night was the scariest. Inmates banging on the walls, throwing up their gang signs, yelling out who they were, where they from. I cried my first night. Can't never let nobody know that. I spent the next few years in and out of cells. Every day I worry, when will I be free? My brother taught me what the life is for a young black man. Do what you have to. Pimp, deal, whatever. Learn what colors to learn. Gang boundaries. You can stay on one corner, you can't stay on another. Learn to be quiet. A wrong word can get you popped. If you look in my eyes, you'll see a loving girl. If you look in my smile, you'll see nothing wrong. If you pull up my shirt, you'll see the bruises. What did I do to make him so mad? At 16, I've seen more dead bodies than a mortician. Every time I step out my door, I'm faced with the risk of being shot. Uh, you're good. To the outside world, it's just another dead body on the street corner. They don't know that he was my friend. During the war in Cambodia, the camp stripped away my father's dignity. He sometimes tries to hurt my mom and me. I feel like I have to protect my family. I was having trouble deciding what candy I wanted. And then I heard gunshots. I looked down to see that one of my friends had blood coming out of his back and his mouth. The next day, I pulled on my shirt and got strapped with a gun I found in an alley by my house. I don't even know how this war started. It's just two sides who tripped each other way back. Who cares about the history behind it? I am my father's daughter, and when they call me to testify, I will protect my own no matter what. Nobody cares what I do. Why should I bother coming to school? My friends are soldiers, not of war, but of the streets. They fight for their lives. I hate the cold feeling of a gun against my skin. It makes me shiver. It's a crazy ass life. Once you're in, there's no getting out. Every time I jump somebody in and make someone a part of our gang, it's another baptism. They give us their life, we give them a new one. I've lost many friends who have died in the undeclared war. To the soldiers and me, it's all work. Risking life, dodging bullets, pulling triggers. It's all work.